Oh my god. Woo! It's a bit like a dinosaur. I reckon we can stay here. As you can see, there is a big flathead. Oh my god. It's right next to his head. Fly, my friend, fly. He reckons it's a good flatty. Just spotted another floaty at the drone, right under it. Back everyone, something a bit different today. We're doing some land-based fishing in this inlet of New South Wales. It's actually um, Marimbula, and um, we've never been here before, so we've got a plastic. We're at the mouth of a river, so I'm assuming there would be some salmon, um, floodies, see what's around. So gonna flick around the edges, in the holes, in the gutters. So we're just going to the point now. There's a couple of people swimming, fishing, spear fishing, so see how we go. Looks like the other side might be a bit better, but you never know. Anyway, it's all about exploring today, or this afternoon anyway, see how we go. And uh, we'll try in the river too if we, if we get nothing there, but just gotta watch these rocks and go from there. Looks like a lot of current. Looks a bit more promising just out there. Oh, there's a fish jumping out of the water. But um, I'll have a crack in here. Ooh, the water is not warm. Oh, look at all the mullet, man. Full of mullet. Absolutely full of mullet. Loads of them. Well, I'm hitting the mullet with my lure. That's how many there are. Alrighty, as you can see, it is low tide. We actually went up the river. Um, I just had a quick look further up um, in the opening, and it's pretty much all rock. And I've got no shoot. Oh, there's like a nice brim or something swimming. Oh. Where should I get a fish first cast? Pretty sure I saw a nice, oh, there's a nice fish swimming. Hopefully it's a brim. Anyway, we're just gonna work our way up this river and see what we can find. All right, let's have a flick under here. Oh, look at that skip. It's actually a nice little drop in here. Do I have a hit? Alrighty, we just cast right where that boat is. You can see those things there actually oysters. Um, and that's an oyster farm. So generally when you find that sort of stuff, um, there's brim and floodies and all those sort of species not too far behind. I'm not too sure about the low tide though, it's very, very low, um, which can affect the fishing big time. Yeah. Oh, there they are, they're mullet. They're monster mullet. Look at the size of them. Oh my God. I don't know if they get lures though. Imagine they get lures, they'll be sick as. Oh my God, we jagged one. <laughs> wow, well we got a fish. <laughs> I'm putting you back mate, so don't worry. But that is sick as. I was just winding through the school. Oh, there's all big fish following it too. No way that's a mullet. That is huge, man. That is a big mullet. Big mullet. Look how many there are. Oh no, he's put me in the weed. I only got like four, six pound leader on here. 
and six pound braid. I'm getting rolled by a mullet. <laughs> Good fun anyway. Oh my God. <laughs> now he's going against the current. Wow. Come on, mate. He's coming in. You watch him, he'll probably do another run. As soon as he gets close to that edge, yeah, he's, he's getting tired, he's getting tired. My buddy wrist is getting tired just from holding the rod. Jesus. Well, they're definitely um, not small. What I'm gonna do is um, go a bit close to the edge. That way we can net him. Oh, look at the mullet following him. Look at that. He's like right under him. Oh, oh, it's a different type of mullet. Oh, look at the mullet right on him. Oh, shit. Oh. I think this is called a sea mullet, this one. I don't think they eat bait all lures, these things. So it's pretty cool to catch one like that. Well, obviously I jagged him, but still, if I land him, it'd be pretty cool. Not sure if I've ever caught one of these before. Come on, mate. Pretty much got him now. Pretty much got him. Woo. Well, we got the mullet. Look at that. That is a big dog, that's for sure. Just hold him up to show you guys. Just take, like literally, look at that, just came off. Just got him in the scale. Wow. So this guy's ready to go. But look at that. Definitely not a yellow eye mullet, that thing. Look at its uh, eyeballs. Very good size uh, sea mullet. How good is that? Let's put him back. He's got big bloody spines, that's for sure. This guy's wrecked. <laughs> He's exhausted. Off you go, big fella. Uh, okay. Four centimetre play here earlier. Like Today? Ago, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's all right, yeah. Just using two and a half inch grubs and stuff. Yeah. Because no, yeah. um, I got this, which will get the flatties. Yeah. I was surprised that I haven't caught a salmon or anything like that yet. Is there salmon normally in here and Taylor and stuff? Uh, apparently, the guys that own this house, apparently there's like, there was a, like heaps of salmon here a while ago. Yeah. Like, through the whole entry. I do remember that. That's why I drove here, just to see if they're around, but. Yeah, I haven't got any. Have you fished like up that way before? Just here, yeah. Surely we'll have a quick cast at this boat right here. Yeah. Ooh, that was a hit. Oh, oh yeah, there's Taylor. I just got um, cut off. Cast your lure in. Lucky I've got my back up. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a school of Taylor in. They must be decent size. We'll see if they're Taylor anyway. Oh, this weed get lost. 
They have to be Taylor. I got a clean cut on the drop. You got Taylor here. Yep, there we go. Oh, what is that? The hell is this? It's a good fish. I think it's a good, oh, it's a good tailor. Oh yeah. Woo! Woo! Ho <laughs> ho! That's a good tail, that buddy thing. Shit, yeah. Good fish. There we go, guys. Just got cut off on the on the grub, literally on the drop. So there's only one thing that can do that. These guys, especially in the estuary here. And uh, got him straight in the top lip. Just don't, don't crush on me, my lure, mate. I need that. And you're going back, so don't worry. But... That is a nice tailor. So I've got a mullet and a tailor. Let's put him back. Do you want to eat it or do you want to put it back? Put it back. No, you're all good. Oop. He literally just, oh, he's in there. <laughs> Look at him, just hiding in the, in the weed there. Just gonna have a flick with the grub. The tide is coming up now. That line there had no water in it, so it's coming up. So that's actually a really good uh, thing in terms of uh, fishing. As far as fishing this bank, it's not gonna be too good but we'll do what we've got at the moment and then we can always go to the uh, the bridge up there. We just hooked up guys on the, uh, the white plastic, right on the edge. Whatever this is, just smacked it. I'm tipping. Oh, didn't come off, did it? Oh, it's in, it's in the weed. I don't know what this is actually. You'd think it'd be a fuddy since it was on the edge, but you never know. No, he's in the weed. Come on, come out, mate. Come out. Come on. I've got to go out here. Yep, we got him out. Has to be a fighty. It's got to be. What is that? Oh, it's a... Is that a brim? Did I just jag it? Oh! I jagged a bloody luderick. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> what is it with jagging fish today? Oh my god. I've never caught one of these before. I've caught zebra fish, but not luderick. Wow, that is awesome, that thing. Look at that. Put him in the hole there. Bring him up here. Well, look how cool that is. It's a luderick. I've never caught one before. I've caught um, zebrafish before. They're the same family. The difference is they're a, a more silver color and their stripes are a lot different. Oops. And look what I got him on. Right in the, in the side there. Well, that came off. But also you can tell by the um, their head in their mouth. They're designed to eat all that weed and these are generally actually weed eaters. Looks a bit like a dinosaur, the front of its head there. But um, that is sick as. Another species ticked off the list. Let's put him back, eh? As you can see, got my rods there in this little sling bag. It's all over the place, but let's um, put this guy back. Off you go, dude. 
How sick is that? Another species off the list. In general, I've never got one of them before, so pretty cool. But um, yeah, we've got a mullet, we've got a tailor, we've got a luderick. Um, tide's coming up, so hopefully some more species to tick off the list. Look at that, that was, that was all sand. Now it's starting to go under. So yeah, we don't really have much area to cover now. As you can see, the tide is coming up a lot. We've got our two inch grub. Oh, there's all fish in the weed in here. And because the tide's coming up, that pole, well you'd think anyway, that it should hold some fish. So we're just gonna go a little bit closer without stepping on anything very weird or sharp. And that's pretty much close enough, I'd say. I'm just gonna flick along that. See if there's a fish there. Oh, I think I got that on film. <laughs> now we'll have a whip with the OG. Well, that's um, the session done at this location. Uh, Awesome place, especially if the incoming tide is just uh, dead. It's not much, um, not much action at all. I was expecting a few more tailor, maybe some salmon, flatties, but that's fishing. So what I'm going to do is get in the car and uh, we're going to go to one more location. See you there. Look at that little stingray. Look at its bloody um, barb. Well, it's tail anyway. So we're using a prawn sort of lure there. And as I flick it with the rod tip, the tail goes absolutely crazy. So what we're doing, not too sure if floodies get lures at night, but we're going to give it a crack anyway. What the? F oh my God. Have you ever seen a possum do that? <laughs> Oh my god. I've never seen a possum go on two bloody legs. I thought it was gonna get me that thing. How's it going? Good, how's it going? Yeah, good, good. Any luck? Yeah, got a few options. Yeah, hard land base, yeah. Yeah, that's why you got a bit of everything on, so see how we go. See how you go, yeah. Cheers, mate. Look at that, there's a um, mullet and garfish in the water already. Oh, look at that, whole school of brim, Jesus. There you go, there's a local there, caught a few fish. Um, we're just gonna muck around here and see how we go. There's a lot of bait fish in the water, so that's a really, really good sign. Um, I'll show you exactly what I'm using. So we've got a light outfit with a two and a half inch grub. We've got a, uh, a mullet paddle tail sort of lure. Um, it's probably about five inches. And then we've got this bad boy with a homemade little rig there for treble. Um, so, so yeah, we'll just um, give everything a crack and see what we can get. If we can get a brim, that'll be good. If we can get a fuddy, even better. So, let's start flicking. Alrighty. Not bad, not bad. Doesn't cast too far, obviously. Who knows how deep it is here. But we'll just let it sit there for a bit. And with this, because it's a paddle tail, just wind it and you can twitch it. And if there's a big fuddy, mate, we're on. Where are all the garfish following me bloody lure? So I've just got two rods with me. One in this little pouch here. One in my hand. There's a lot of mullet around, so we'll try this um this edge here. Maybe there's like a floody just waiting for a mullet to go straight past him. Oh, 
If you quickly give me the net, I might be able to get some for you. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Thank we'll, you. we'll see how we go. Just be quiet. Just stay there, stay there, stay there. And they're pawning the nets as well. Oh, they're right there. They're you know what I'll do? Look, they're coming in. If I stay still, he might come to me. The fish might come to me. Look, they're... <laughs> they're, they're a bit too fast. Yeah, you don't want to get those ones, you want to get the big ones. They're, they're dip. No, they're, they're swam off. You have to wait until they come back. Ooh, something had to go with those mullet. Oh, time to move spots again. How's it going? Just get garbage yet, yet. Not chasing fuddies. Yeah, I've never fished that before, so hopefully you can get me first dusky or something. Oh, okay. so. I've never done it either, so. Oh, there we go. Oh, Gari. Oh, it just came off. <laughs> yeah, there's plenty of them around. Oh, look at all the mullet. Ooh. I reckon we just stay here. As you can see, right here is actually a footpath. So the water's pretty high, I'd say so. So we're just going to try along the edge and then... I'm not sure if we can get around that corner, but we'll just see how we go. So I've walked from down there, the opening's just there, and the water's that high that that right there is underwater. So we're just in this little area, there's not much area to fish, but we're just gonna stay here and just keep on casting. And hopefully something awesome swims by and uh, snatches the lure, eh? So, even get a fish under this pier. Oh, little sandbag. He scoffed it too. There we go. First fish, little sambo, and he scoffed it. A fuddy would destroy him, but he's undersized. What a morning, we're in Malakudo with Nick over here and uh, we're going to see if we can get some crocodiles. I'm on. Oh, it's a tailor. And didn't even hook him in the mouth. <laughs> Straight out for Ivy. You on? Yeah. Have a hit. Yeah. Do you hear that? Gunshots. Little shits. I saw they get it too. See the brim? Oh shit! Got that on film. They see the brim underneath the the jetty there. Feed him. Oh. That is a good spot there, surely.
drive there and I'll, I'll keep an eye on him. Alright, he's still there. Yep. Alright All right, guys, I've literally just put the drone up and there is a big flathead. So unfortunately electric's down. So we're going to quickly sneak up on him and we're going to cast a lure straight at him and um, hopefully he eats. You want to come in on the side of him? Don't just tell us where you want me to go, man. I reckon... We're going to have to go on this side because it's too shallow, isn't it? Yeah, go around. Yep. Go around like way out there and you know what we'll do? We'll drift on him. Right. I'll keep an eye on him. Man, that is a good fish. Yeah, That's yeah. like 80 easy. Oh, there's two next to each other. There's two? Yes. No, one's a brim. Where's the drone? Oh, it's there. All right. Stop there. Where's the drone? Oh, it's there. Oh, he's moving. It's right next to him. Oh, I'm gonna go right on him, man. Oh my God. It's right next to his head. Oh. Get in. Didn't want it. Man, like I went like right next to his head. And now he's Swimming off. Well, you're joking. Keep an eye on him. Where's he going? He's not hungry. Which way do you go, man? Where the drone is. Yeah. It's all the way there, is it? He's not as big, but he still looks all right. Yeah. <laughs> There's actually a flathead, another flathead, just spotted. So we're actually going to walk to him. Um, the big. Floody, literally didn't want to eat, but we're in pretty much ankle deep water and there's another floody there. So just gonna go up to him and uh, hopefully this one eats. He looks a bit smaller, so hopefully he does. Have a cast from this stick here. Go mate. Straight under the drone. Oh, you're just on the right side of him. You should still go for it though. Wind it. See him there? See him there? Alright. Can you see my line? Yep, perfectly. Alright, let me have a look. You want to go about a foot to your left? Which way? See my law? See my law? Yep. <laughs> He's intense, man. <sighs> I can't believe that. Now he's sitting here. Why isn't he eating? Like a fly rod or something, I don't know. It's like, be a yeah, but I don't know why they're not feeding. Hmm. Well, at least I got that one on film. That's great. Yeah. Just spotted another floaty at the drone, right under it. Go have your cast. Oh, quick, he's going. Just... Fly, my friend, fly. He reckons it's a good floaty. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> On the plastic, huh? No, that's the 
hard body big one again. Oh. Yeah, well, a good one. He's like, what, 60? Oh, <laughs> man. That's a good one. Yeah, really nice one, yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh, that's a fat fish. <laughs> hey, good shit. You want one of them hard bodies to tie on? I think I've got stuff like that. Yeah. That's a beast. Do you reckon they'll get this or maybe too big? No, it was a gay. I'll have a crack. There's heaps of holes and yeah, that was just... But I, you know why I didn't say on the drone? It's deep there. Yeah. And they must be just hiding in the shadows there. That's a, that's a good fish. Water. I got a brag mat in the yeah, boat too. Yeah, there. Good fish. Good stuff, mate. Nice 65. So matter fuddy. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Oh, what is it? Oh my god. Do you want to eat it? It's a dog. We got a flatty. It's a dog. Oh, it just came off. Do you want that? So pretty much uh, this morning, we marked and found some good fish on the drone. Casted all different lures, no takers. Uh, Nick got a couple land-based, and uh, we actually went in for some lunch, had a bit of a break, charged the cameras up. Back out again, as you can see, it is pretty overcast, but we've got a little flatty on the board. No monster, but um, it's a start. So let's start flicking until the sun goes down, see what we can manage.